I don't recognize this man. I don't, I don't know who this guy is. Maybe this is who he always was. Sister Wives' latest update. Mary Brown gets candid about what caused her marriage demise. Janelle Brown shocks in hot pink mini dress. Tony explains Cleek's inside Cody's family. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. After watching these videos, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Mary Brown gets candid about what caused her marriage demise. Sister Wives star Mary Brown is getting candid about what caused the demise of her 30-year marriage. She and Cody Brown wed in 1990 but announced their split at the beginning of 2023. Yet it had long been over when this announcement was formally made. So what was the clincher for Cody's former first wife? Mary Brown gets candid about what caused her marriage demise. For a long time now, Cody Brown has openly said that he and his first wife, Mary Brown, are nothing more than friends. She even admitted that they had not been intimate in over a decade. Yet, she kept holding on to the plural marriage because it was something that she really believed in. Plus, she seemed to really love and adore Cody very much while wanting to make this unit they had created work. Finally, she realized that this was never going to be what she had hoped it would be and threw the towel in after giving it her all. Now, the mother of one is opening up about what really caused the demise of her marriage. Obviously, fans saw a lot on Sister Wives, but was there more to it? According to People, Mary Brown claimed that jealousy was a factor in ending her three-decade union. Anytime that you expand your family, there's going to be a shift. You've got just the logistical things, but then you've also got the emotional things. I'm human, I'm going to get jealous, he's human, he is going to not know how to deal with a woman's jealousy. She went on to note that, even when they first got married, they were not mature enough to be polygamous. Mary shared that in their late teens and early 20s, they may have felt they were capable of handling plural marriage. However, she explained that some are just either not grown up enough or lack the essential tools to make it. This is actually quite the opposite picture of what was painted on the show as to why they fell off. What fans saw, it appeared that Cody and Mary Brown were struggling so she sought comfort on the internet. That was when she got catfished and, around the same time, Mary had told Cody she needed space. She claimed that she never expected him to leave for good. He has said that she never wooed him anymore, but there is footage of her actively trying to be romantic. Sadly, he just pulled away from her. Fans felt Mary looked desperate throughout it all and were happy when she realized it was done. Fortunately, she has successful businesses and is living her best life. Do you think jealousy is really why Mary and Cody parted ways? Sister Wives Janelle Brown shocks in hot pink mini dress. Sister Wives star Janelle Brown is shocking her fans while donning a hot pink mini dress. This is quite the switch for the mother of six who tends to opt for darker colors. Now, she is stepping out and looking fabulous now that she is a single lady. Sister Wives Janelle Brown shocks in hot pink mini dress. All of Cody Brown's wives dressed very conservatively at the beginning of the Sister Wives run. They opted to cover their arms, and if they wore t-shirts or tank tops, they always had a long sleeved shirt underneath. As time went on, they started to spice things up and introduce some colors, patterns, and denim. Yet, former second wife, Janelle Brown always kept to darker colors, occasionally wearing polka dots in later seasons. Once she started to work out and indulge in self-care, she changed up the way that she dressed and what she was willing to wear. Now she has completely stepped out of the box and wore something the old Janelle Brown never would have selected. While out with her former sister wife, Christine Brown, Janelle stepped it up. She was seen in a hot pink mini dress with a V-neck, slightly puffed sleeves, and a little flow on the bottom. Her blonde hair was done and brushed away from her face, 
and she was positively glowing, as was Christine. Of course, Christine went for bridal white, which they showcased on their Instagram. Fans immediately flocked to the comment section to send praise to Janelle over how amazing she looked. Janelle's skin is glowing. Gorgeous mama, one person wrote. Another added, Janelle in that hot pink. One follower told the ladies that they were goals while it was noted they looked better since they ditched Cody. Aside from the fact that they looked amazing, fans strongly believed that they really got better leaving the plural family. Best Lies Season 18 of Sister Wives has picked up a few months after the last one. Christine Brown is now living in Utah and is happier than ever, grateful that she is not married to Cody any longer. As for Janelle Brown, it is clear that she has had enough of Cody and being married to him. She will reach a breaking point in the season and has already publicly revealed that they are separated. At this point, the only wife he has left is his fourth one, Robin Brown. Clearly, leaving him was the best decision and she is tickled pink. What do you think of Janelle's new hot pink mini moment? Should she keep rocking the bright colors? Let us know and watch Sister Wives Sundays on TLC. Sister Wives Tony explains cliques inside Cody's family. Sister Wives star Tony Padron explains that inside Cody Brown's family, there are cliques, and if you find yourself outside of one, it could be awful. While you might not catch it on the screen, Tony says it happens. He started this dialogue after Robin Brown reported she feels like an outsider, as do her kids. So, Tony explains that people within Cody Brown's family can feel that way from time to time. Even his wife, Michael T. Brown Padron, felt like this before. That's because these cliques form, and you can find yourself an outsider if you are not included. Sister Wives, Tony Padron spills the beans on Cody Brown's clan. Tony Padron and his wife, Michael T. Brown Padron, are one of the few adults from inside Cody's family who have relationship with Robin Brown. That's because when Michael T. was a teen, she was having problems at home with her siblings. So she moved in with her father's fourth wife for a while. She helped out with the kids and looked at Robin as someone who was there for her. She really needed the kindness her father's youngest wife offered her at the time. So when Tony Padron talks about cliques and finding yourself outside of one, it sounds like he knew a lot about it due to his wife's experience. Because of this, Tony and his wife explain how a bond formed with Cody Brown's youngest wife that is still strong today. Tony the family guy Tony Padron seems the polar opposite of Cody Brown when it comes to taking on dad duties. The sister wives' moms were in charge of raising their kids. From what Christine Brown said, it sounds as if Cody did very little of the daily tasks associated with young kids. This former third wife of the sister wives family told a story of how Cody wouldn't even put the kids to bed for her. The other moms helped one another early on, but it sounds as if Cody pretty much stayed a hands-free dad when it came to a lot of the work associated with raising kids. Then there's Tony Padron. His wife just spent time away with her mom and siblings in Europe. While Tony had help from his mom and sisters, he stayed home and happily took care of his three kids. And his babies are all under the age of three. Tony is also a one-woman husband who idolizes his wife. Sister Wives, Cody's Family Quarrels While Tony and Michael T. didn't do too much defending of Robin, the sister wife's daughter made it clear she has a bond with Robin. Their relationship has deep roots going back to a time when Michael T. needed support. Michael T. and Tony Patron were also part of that now-defunct gift exchange between all of Cody Brown's children. Tempers flared as the children of Cody Brown attempted to orchestrate the exchange, but it failed horribly. Michael T. said that the holiday exchange among her siblings got out of hand. Fans heard what the other wives had to say about it and formed the assumption that Cody Brown's wife number four got involved when maybe she shouldn't. It sounded like the kids started the exchange and Robin somehow involved herself in this. 
she tried to set up a video call for all Cody Brown's kids. But due to the schedules of the 25 people involved, there wasn't a time that worked for everyone. But instead, Robin took this as they refused to do the video call because it was her idea. Tony seemed to think his theory of sister wives' cliques also played a part. Tony and my Kelty Padron say it wasn't Robin Brown. My Kelty said scheduling a video call failed for only one reason. Too many conflicting schedules were to blame, not Cody's youngest wife. But the communication regarding this video call was done via text messages. So, as many people know, the written word in a message doesn't always sound like it was intended to sound. So, things were taken wrong, which ended the gift exchange with hurt feelings. It looks like more evidence for Tommy Padron's theory of cliques surface on the next new Sister Wise episode. Thanks for watching these videos. Please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.